Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Emily Freibler. So today's video I'm gonna be talking about the gel nail polish kit that I got from Amazon. I've been trying it out now for over a month, I believe, and I actually have them on my nails right now. So I'm gonna be showing you how I use it, why I like it, all the stuff like that. And I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. I upload new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, but during December, I'm doing Vlogmas. Let's get started with the video. All right, you guys, so I got this kit from Amazon. I believe it was $40. I'll put the info on the screen, show you what it looks like, everything like that. And of course, I will link it in the description box for you guys. So I wanted to try out gel nails because I've tried dip nails from, I got a, a set from Kiss. I actually did a whole video on that and I really liked those for a while except for they would crack a little bit and stuff like that so I wanted to see if I could do gel nails at home and they would last for multiple weeks so the one I have on my nails right now is this blue color the kit came with I think five or six different colors which was amazing it has a couple like pinky shades a nude a um, black a white and this like bluish gray shade which I think is really pretty as well I've tried three of the shades, I believe, so far, and I really like them. So the first couple times I tried it, I did it what, how they said and everything, and the first time it lasted okay, but it still chipped and stuff, and then the second time didn't really work that well. And then the third time I changed some things up, and now this is one week, and they look basically perfect. My nails haven't really chipped at all or anything. I mean, there's a little bit of wear and tear because I really like use my nails for things, which I probably shouldn't since I want my, my manicure to stay good, you know? But anyway, this is one week and they are not budging. So I believe they're gonna be totally fine for a couple weeks of wear, like two, maybe three pushing it. Actually, this is over a week now. This is like a week and a couple days. The reason I think it actually works this time is because while I'm doing the steps, like I'll show you guys all the steps and everything, but I added another layer of base coat and another layer of top coat. And I think that is really what has um, transformed it so that it actually works you know anyway let's get into me applying it and i will show you kind of what it looks like and everything like that for applying everything first all you have like so many things in this kit you get like alcohol pads, you get um, pads to actually remove the nail polish, which is amazing. You get cuticle tools and brushes and stuff. And then also all the things to buff and everything. So you have literally everything you need to do, and more, I believe, to do this entire manicure, which is so amazing. It's only $40. All the bottles look really, really miniature, but they explain that there's actually as much product as other companies in them, which I think is totally fine because I'm only paying $40 for all of this stuff. So you get a base coat, top coat, all these different colors, and for the applying and everything like that, so what you do is you start with the base coat. You wanna make sure you have a little bit of your top part of your nails, like the shine, buffed off. So I just use the nail file and just buff off the top layer. Then I use an alcohol pad to wipe everything nice and clean so there's no residue no oils on there so everything's gonna stick really nicely and then I go in with the base coat and you make sure that you get a nice thin layer it's really important that you get thin layers when you're doing this so that it doesn't like all peel off in one chunk later on and stuff. So you want thin layers of the nail polish. Make sure you do that. And so I do a layer on every single nail and then I put it under the light, which is, this light is so, so cute and little and it, trust me, it does work. I believe you just let it stay under there for 45 seconds and then you take it out. And what I do is do one more base coat. So when I first was doing it, I only did one base coat. Um, and it didn't stay as well. So I did another layer of a thin base coat, put it underneath for another 45 seconds, and then you go into whatever color you want. So then again, I just paint a thin layer of the base coat or of the color onto my nails. And because you can do multiple layers, you don't want like a thick goopy layer. It's gonna lay a lot nicer on your nails if you do thin layers. So I do a thin layer of that and then put it back under the light. And so usually I do about two layers of the color, maybe three if I want it to be super, super like nice and flawless, but two is usually totally fine. 
And so then I put it under there and I repeat the steps a couple times and then I go into the top coat and then the top coat, you literally do the same thing. All you're doing is painting your nails. It's so straightforward, so easy. You just paint your nails with the top coat. And at this point, I like to kind of cap off the top of the nail so that it's not... It like, I don't know, it rounds the edge, I guess. It's like another protective layer so that it's not gonna peel off at the edge there. And then again, I just put it under the light for 45 seconds and then I take it back out and I do another layer. And what I do is the same thing, another thin layer on the nails, put them back in and then this time I like to leave them in a little bit longer just to make sure they're nice and cured and good. So I probably do two of the cycles of the light and then I'm good to go. And so literally you don't need to wipe off any residue, you don't need to do anything, you have your gel nails and you're literally it's all done. It's so simple, so straightforward. I know there's multiple layers that you have to do. It's probably like six times that you're painting each hand and putting it under the light but for not having to paint my nails like every couple days because they're chipping and whatever and they last multiple weeks and they still look really nice and they're shiny and beautiful, then I think it's totally worth it in my opinion. So yeah, that's how I apply everything and it works really nicely. When I'm ready to take everything off, all I do is file off the top layer, like the shiny part of the nail, just like a little bit buff it off. And then they even included like these um, acetone little pouches. And what you do is you rip it open and it has the little thing in there. You just slide your finger in and then that has a sticky part that you rip off and then you fold the tabs over so they stay really, really nicely. It's amazing. I am so in love with this like invention instead of I used to take cotton pads put it on there with acetone and then I would wrap it in tin foil and it got so messy and it was ridiculous these are so easy so seamless and then I leave my nails in there for about 10 to 15 minutes until I feel like they're really you know coming off and stuff and then there's like this scraper tool which this is the key and everything just crumbles right off so you start with the scraper and you just kind of brush off and scrape off all the nail stuff and it comes right off you're not going to damage your nail don't pick these don't like try and peel them off because your normal nail underneath will get attached and it will like rip and your nails are going to be ruined so if you do these steps and you take them off properly you're not going to ruin your nails which is amazing so yeah, that's how I do these nails and I think they're so beautiful. I love that I can do gel nails at home. This by far is my favorite way to do my nails. I did like the dip in the past and the dip is a little bit like harder. It feels more kind of like acrylic type of thing, but I really like the gel, you guys, and I think the gel lasts a lot longer than the Kiss one does. So if you like doing your nails at home, I highly, highly, highly recommend picking up a kit like this or this kit in, in particular. I think the color options are beautiful. They're really like up my alley for colors. So I hope you guys liked this video. Um, I know it's a little bit different for me, but I love nails and I love having nice looking nails without spending so much money. Like it would take, or it would be like $40 to do a normal one set of gel nails at a salon. So this is so affordable, so amazing. You get multiple, multiple applications with this set. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. I upload new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in a video very, very soon.